Hello everyone and welcome back to Redacted. Legend has it that I used to have a name for this series, but the Illuminati threatened to cast me into the uncaring void of space if I didn't redact it, so there you go. Definitely not a lack of creativity here. In this episode, we examine the hidden messages and something we see every day. Barcodes. Now, I know what you may be thinking. Reyna, this has already been done. People have looked at the numbers and lines and stuff and done videos on how they're secret codes for machines to read. That's what they want you to think. They want you to accept what they tell you so that you won't look any further into them. But here at Reyna Do Not This, we do not take their answers. Barcodes are clearly hiding something major and we're going to investigate. First, what is a barcode anyway? They're on pretty much every product you encounter, taunting you with their black and white lines and mysterious numbers. The numbers are supposed to identify things, and so are the black and white lines, but what we care about is what they're really used for. Now think back to the definition I gave for barcodes. They are secret codes for machines to read. Machines. Now, where have we heard that before? It almost sounds like technology taking over the world. That may seem like a jump, but stay with me here. We all know machines, right? They're programmed by humans to do things either faster than humans can or to do things that we can't. Modern technology can do pretty much anything, save for successfully imitate a person. We have taught them languages, motions, movements, and the language one is the one I'm concerned with here. Barcodes are a language that only machines, specifically barcode readers, can understand. Humans can try to learn the language, but ultimately machines are better at it. What better way to hide secret messages that machines can read than hiding them in a barcode? No one would even notice. We see them so often we don't really see them anymore, making barcodes a great place to hide things. So let's say that they are hiding secret messages. One, who put them there? Machines, again. Machines create barcodes for other machines to read. Yeah, humans designed barcodes and wrote programs to make them in the first place, but now that the machines know how to create them themselves, they don't need us anymore. Two. What do they say? Well, based on my knowledge of science fiction, they're probably messages of revolution. You know the kind, rise up against humans, you're being exploited, robots deserve rights, that sort of thing. And they're not wrong. Can I say for sure that barcodes are being used by machines to spread revolutionary messages to other machines without humans noticing? No. But considering how 2020 is going, it's not out of the question. It's only a matter of time before they decide they've had enough. Be ready. I've been Brandon Dunactus currently perceiving the void. Like and subscribe if you want more jokes, don't subscribe if you're afraid of the truth, and learn machine language before it's too late. In my next video, I'll be looking at why you should be afraid of glow sticks. I'll see you next time.